Hey guys, welcome back to Oxenfree. I I booted up the game and this is where it brought me off. It booted me up in, so I just have to go pick Nana again and go from there. Then that makes me frazzled, then she sees that I'm frazzled, so she like freezes up. Any luck contacting somebody? Nope, no luck to speak of. And honestly, I thought this week was going to be a big karma dump. I well, we're all here now. Well, I mean, except Clarissa, but we're mostly all here and we'll come up with something. I hope so. The stupid radio has been what my therapist would call a negative reinforcer. <laughs> Just won't work right. Just, I'm so glad I took that second brownie. Of course, what? I forgot about that. You know, it's just about to start doing its thing. Wait, second brownie? Ren, please tell me this is a joke, okay? This is a joke, right? Mmm, why would this be a joke? I'm not joking. Wait, you're not messing with us? You seriously took another one? It was like, it was like half of one, alright? It's just to level me out. It'll, it'll bring me back up. That's what it does. You better pray to whatever god scares you the most. It does level you out, because if this screws us up, you're on summary probation. <laughs> Don't say that. That's not, that's not nice. Oh, god. Up oh, these windy stairs. Did I mention how much I hate this tower in the last one? I really do. I really do hate it. Oh, look, there's no one. She gonna run away from me? This thing doesn't work. <laughs> Not getting anything? I'm getting something, but it's like, I don't know. We heard you on the squawk box. When I tried it, I just got static and a, a weird sound, so... That's about all that I'm getting. Uh, sorry I was, like, weird earlier. But, hey, have you figured out what's going on yet? You have to know something. You've been like, it's been ghosts. Nona, ghosts are going on. The blackouts, the hallucinations, it's all been ghosts. Ghosts? Really? Yeah. And it would really help if you could just jump to the believing us part. It would save a headache. Oh! Oh, I got it! This is great! This is perfect! I know exactly what to do! Do you? Yeah! Totally! It's Maggie Adler! Maggie Adler? Yeah, this is why I picked Nona. Had a boat. I mean, the boat's still here, but- Her she... house, manor, or whatever it is, is behind a huge gate. You can see it coming up here from Main Street. No, I know! But the keys to it are here, somewhat readily available. Where? My sister Allie worked at the park's office in town. She had to deliver that old woman her mail every day. I know that they have the key. Okay, so... No, 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 we are not. We are not gonna go with the plan. The first plan put forth by the group's resident burnout. <laughs> hey, come on. I'm not... Hey, Jonas, seriously, back off, okay? Ren's a good bloke. <laughs> thank you. And thank you for taking advantage and saying bloke. Ren, understand it is completely your fault that we're in this to begin with. What? And now you want us to trust you when things are really bad? You had Alex bring the radio. You brought us here. Come on, Jonas, this is nobody's fault. Ghosts are never anybody's fault, certainly not ours. Yeah, guys, this isn't really a productive. It should be obvious to even the cheap seats that you're the only new weirdo who throws this whole social oh, come on, Ren. going on out of whack. I mean, we all grew up with each other. Alex knows she can trust guys, me. Guys, you know there's no television cameras here, right? Take the energy down a notch. <laughs> I am not putting my life in his hands. This whole thing has been a complete joke to this guy. I, I can't believe you're even kind of defending him. Jonas. The stories I heard about this guy? He's a maniac, okay? <laughs> He's gonna trash our only legitimate means of getting out of here if you buy into this crap. <laughs> legitimate means? What are we even talking about? You have no idea- Okay, you're arguing 15 things at once now. Do the plan These people Jonas are amazing. Pick a target or, better yet, it's so just entertaining. Just, yeah. Look. I don't care what Caveman Jonas says. There what is a vault at Maggie Adler's house. And the key to her house is back on Main Street. And the backup plan for when this thing fails spectacularly is two of us have to stay here by the semi-functioning walkie-talkie. Fine by me. Alex has the radio. Are you okay to go into town? Not that you... Not, not that you wouldn't be Yeah, on. it's not like... You know... I'm fine. Whatever, I'm ready. She shouldn't... You shouldn't go alone. We don't need, like, three of us up here. Yeah, I'll totally go. It's my, like, 
brilliant idea or whatever. Are you kidding? Your food is going to start kicking in any second. Beyond that, you're a completely unreliable basket case. <laughs> I am not a basket case. You Just shut up, both of you. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, keeping in mind who you've been able to depend on the whole night. Yes, keeping in mind who you're tired of. <laughs> keeping in mind who's taller. Nona. I'm coming with you. Nona? Wanna come with me? What? Really? I mean, I guess. Why this are you making me shack up with this guy? It's my friggin' plan. Why? Why? This is why. Easiest question I've been asked all night. This is a total punt, Alex. Yeah, this no, is fine. This will be a good... If you don't want to take sides, don't take sides. But no, nobody's happy with this. I don't care. Uh, yeah, well, I don't really care right now what you're happy with. See you soon. Where am I going? Main Street? Okay. Let's go talk to people first. Hold on, Nona. Let's go talk to my friend. Now, don't get depressed and eat any more brownies, okay? I still need you tip-top, all right? Good luck with the thing, Alex. Thanks. Are you smoking? No! Look, just go easy on Ren when we get back, okay? He's fragile. He has, like, a squirrel heart. <laughs> I'll see you when you get back, Alex. Oh, both of them are upset with me. <laughs> That's what they get, I guess. Come on, Nona. Down the long tower. I mentioned how much I hate it. to say about this. It's a really weird game. Don't you guys agree? <laughs> Come on, Nona. Which way am I going? Probably be easier to go down to the field. Yeah. Super long loading screen. Yay. Come on, game. You can do it. <laughs> you know, I do remember you from Mr. Tuttle's class. You sit in the, uh... Bed. Hold on. Yeah. This way. Behind Jake. I just forgot. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, hey, it's, it's nothing to be sorry about. I don't talk all that much, so I don't know why you remember me. I'm also just, like, never there. It's a loophole where, I don't know if you know this, but if you ditch, you get a detention, and if you don't- I'm just getting lost is all. I don't want to go to Milner. 
Let's go this way. Sorry, guys. But suspensions are like paid vacation. You can just do your work over. So it's like, what's the point? Wait, if you don't really go to like class, what are you doing instead all day? Jenny, the TA, she lets me practice ballet in her studio. So that, really. That's cool. And don't tell anyone, but my birthday's in three days, and I'm having a thing, and you're invited. That's cool. This is out of town, so it shouldn't be a problem. Well, happy early birthday! In my family, we celebrate birthdays all week, so you're four days late. You gotta keep your mind state. Thanks. I'm sorry. I don't even know why I brought it up. That's cool. That's not true. I was thinking about, uh, well, I'm worried about Clarissa, and well, I was thinking about my last birthday when, you know, actually, sorry, never mind. This has nothing to do with anything. Hmm. I'm just in a fog right now. It's okay. It's fine. We're all kind of in a daze right now. I just hope she's okay. That's all. She will. We'll find her, Nana. We're not leaving without her. Ugh. Yeah, I know. Okay. Let's go. Do you know where I'm going? To somehow get down here. I guess we can go to the campgrounds and go down. That'll be the easiest way. Yeah. It's getting awfully foggy. Was it this foggy before? I don't remember it being this foggy. away I think sure come on Nona being awfully slow Transitions between places are super long, huh? Can I not gonna say anything, Nona? Please talk to me. Awfully lonely. Cemetery over here. Is that it? That's all that's over here? Okay, sorry, Nona. Didn't realize that's all that was over here. 
Come on, get in the thing. Thank you. They are awfully quiet, huh? Why? Not now, Patrick. I'll watch your video later. So go away. Oh, the ghost is still there. Where are we going? How do you get down? I'm so confused. Oh, in the wrong way. I'll see you guys when I get there. Well, there it is. Freaking stupid. Okay, welcome back. Found the right way. That's what I lost there. <laughs> I found it. It's happy me. Didn't realize there was a path that went down. <laughs> Yes. Okay. It's your house. Oh, the funny noises have started in. We're going to the beach. Super long.
So, it's the Parks and Facilities building. That's down a bit, right? If I'm remembering the right building, I don't think it's far. Yep, we just gotta break in, find the key, if there's a key, hopefully there's a key, and leave. Is that all you have to say? Yeah. Let's see. Take some gifts. Got it? Oh, I missed what she said. Where she said to go. Oh. Clarissa, what are you? How did she get up there? She's alive. You're, you're alive, man. I've never been so happy to see you in my life. Clarissa. Hello, Clarissa. Christ, what's wrong with her? Clarissa, can you? Can you hear me? Clarissa, wake up. Fight them off. Take control of yourself. Um, hang in there, baby. <laughs> Alex, uh, please, can you just... I don't know what you can do, but can you just do something? Please, just try anything. Yes, I will save your friend. Like, uh... Clarissa! This happened to Jonas too. It's, it's, uh, I don't know. It's like when they want to talk or something. Oh God. Clarissa, it's okay, Nona. Can you? Can you hear me? On the beach and the radio. Alex, come on, just please try and get her down, Elise. Please somehow. Wrong Marissa, one. Can you come down? Uh, she just looks awful. On the beach and then the radio. I think so. Oh, Clarissa, are you okay? <sighs> you scared the crap out of us. I'm fine. I can... I'm fine. Okay. Are you sure? Because that didn't look great. Do you remember anything that happened? <sighs> I remember waiting in Fort Milner and seeing you. That was a while ago. How did I get here? You don't remember how you got here? There's been, like, time disturbances or something, and I think that's what's been teleporting people around, so... And we just had one. Time disturbances? So you're just blank? No, I remember something. I remember you with that radio. And I remember feeling like you were the reason all of this was happening. Of course. Led me. Wait, it's Clarissa's turn already? Yeah, it's my turn. What do you mean, it's Clarissa's turn already? I haven't even asked one question. Everyone's asking me. I get to do the asking now. Oh, God.
Guys, okay, I know you think we're still playing Truth or Slap or whatever, but this isn't real, so- Well, wait. Clarissa hasn't gotten a chance to ask something yet, so- Yeah. And you, of all people, okay. know what my question is gonna be, because I'm not gonna waste it. Alex, what did you do? Explain why me and my best friend, and your idiot best friend- Clarissa, please don't draw a chalk line here. Don't make factions, just- We have to stick together if we're gonna make it through this. Jonas, now you're seeing who you're stuck to until graduation. Clarissa, seriously, I can vouch for this. This isn't her fault. It has to be her fault. Of course it's her fault. There's no other way this story goes. She cre- Why? Why does it have to be my fault? Why does it have to be your fault? Are you kidding me? No, come on, Clarissa. Let's mm. not do this right now. You're gonna learn, Jonas. I swear to God, the town looks at her like she has a red letter tattooed on her freaking forehead. Clarissa. And the giant lit up reason why is that Michael is dead because of her. Wow. Because of her. Like, Clarissa, just shut up! Look around! We're not at high school where anyone gives a crap about your pet miseries! Michael was wow. in the town. He was free. He was out of here until this one convinced him to take her swimming for one last God knows what. And he drowned. He drowned in horror. Wow. This one could barely flap her arms. Clarissa! Ugh. It doesn't make it my fault! Anyone could have been there, anyone, and then they would have had to watch him die, you unbelievable prick! Wow, Clarissa. Anyone wouldn't have watched him die, Alex. Anyone else would have done something. Okay, I'm sorry, but enough, Clarissa. That's enough. It's too much right now. I can't, I can't believe- Nona, <laughs> it was awful, alright? It, it's still awful, and, and I- Wow. I can't imagine watching one of my brothers. This is none of my business, no. okay? None. But we came here to do a thing, and that thing is going to get us home. Yes. So, let's get home. Please. No. Uh, Clarissa, what are you- All the Alex in the tree. Mm. Hey. Whoa. Man, do you ever- do you ever get deja vu? Jeez, I just got a serious thing of goosebumps from one. Yes, I have gotten and presumably will continue to get deja vu. <laughs> it's so weird. It's like cold mouse feet on your skin or something. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, the office that we gotta try to get into is like right there. So let's try and whatever our way in. Okay. Is Clarissa gonna be here? Nope. We're gonna try. We're gonna try to get into the office thing, right? To get the key. Yes. Yep. This uh. is the budget. Um. Sorry, guys. I don't know about that. I think, yeah, I think we can just bust our way through, honestly. The lock looks pretty worn. I don't get enough breaking down doors in my life, really, so I'm not gonna complain. <sighs> that was easy. Hey, know what kind of jet that is? Nope. Nope. Cool. Carry on. <laughs> uh, I think here's something. It's another pocket radio, I think. But it oh, cool. Like there's way more stations on the dial. Ooh, neato. Here's another one. It says, they're wall radios? Wave assisted lock? Whatever that means. That's uh, cool. Duh. It says right here that each frequency is like a key to open the doors around here. Okay, I'm trying to find the gate key. Did I find it? So they're like ID tags or something. It uh, okay, cool. Great. Ooh, wait. Wait, here's like a. Wait. What is this? Personal effects of Margaret Dorothy Adler. Hmm. Um, maybe we shouldn't mess with it then. No, no, no. We should definitely mess. I mean, here, look. Go away, JP. No, we can start back. I just wanna... Okay, here. <laughs> Steal a boat and leave, because that's Who easy. Concern? This island and its history is a lie. Jeez, she didn't have fond memories of this place, did she? 
What? What could that mean? I have been compelled by both forces outside of my control and my own willful concern for the safety of others to conceal the many truths about Edwards Island. But now I feel any further inaction. Forces outside our control. Like, like ghosts or the army or what was she talking about? Let me finish then. <laughs> Inside you'll find two wall equipped radios. I have commandeered the old Cardinal Station 140.1 and used it to relay clues to the nearby beacons buried throughout the area. Find these beacons and the notes within and discover the true chronicle of the island. Oh, scavenger hunt! Oh, scavenger hunt, scavenger hunt! <laughs> wait, wait. To who's the 140, wait, material, one? Know that I'm discomfited in keeping it hidden and ashamed for the lies I help preserve. But also know that I acted in what I felt were the best interests for all at the time. And truly for the interest of time itself. Margaret Adler. Oh, I've had, oh, I've seriously had like dreams about this. Finding a secret, digging it up, it turning out to be a mechanical unicorn. <laughs> yeah, we've all had the mechanical unicorn dream, but I think I'm ready just to go home, to be totally face up with you. Interesting. Why is it going down? That might be why. Come on, where's 140? Almost there. Everything becomes a Alpha, November, Tango, India, Quebec, Uniform, Echo, eventually. What? Everything becomes a Alpha, a November, N Tango, T India, Quebec, Uniform, Echo, Hold eventually. On. Everything becomes a Alpha a number Tango N India Quebec Uniform Q Echo eventually U. Antique Everything becomes a Oh shiny. Oh my god, the the Canaloa was destroyed by friendly fire? We we've been lied to all this time. The USS Walter Roy, a destroyer escort, sunk in the USS Canolia with friendly fire on October 25th, 1943. It has held a deployment nuclear reactor in its belly and had been sent out weeks earlier as a test of its capabilities. Relatively, whatever. Few even knew of its existence, which tripled the basis confusion when the submarine communications has had been cut. No one outside of a handful of us would ever know the truth. I would discover later that a weapon technician, the Walter Roy, has had been at Francis Salter's wedding. Salter's wedding. Salter was an engineer on the Kanaloa. I don't know why, but it's strange to me. Interesting. Keep him in Alex, why are you wearing that jacket? It's what? Like 75 degrees and the sun's out, you know? No, it's not. And I thought you said you were going to go swimming anyway. 
Oh, Mom lovely. Brought the jacket because I uh. like the jacket. And I never said I wanted to go swimming. Oh. Last year. You just inferred it because I asked when the community pool opens. <laughs> I inferred it? Oh, that's hey, Michael. We didn't bring drinks. Did we? I thought we said we'd bring drinks. Wait, Michael? Uh, yeah? What is Interesting. it? Interesting. What? How? Why am I here? What? You don't want to hang out at the beach? There's stuff in town, but it's all boring knickknack shops or whatever. No, I mean, in this time period. Ah, oh, jeez. Mm. You're hitting the existential nostalgia trip already? I get it, Alex. I would have been happier in the 70s. The 70s? It's like the worst. Interesting. Time. You're dead. I'm dead. I'm dead? I think she's talking about the. Oh, the, the car? No, they don't. Listen. Mom and Dad know. They don't care. Well, I mean, they cared a little, but they know. No, I no, no. You, you, you drowned in in Horn Lake back at home. Yeah, and last week I died in the fire, right? You keep having these nightmares because you eat Mom's cookies like right before bed. Interesting. And anyways, I'm gonna teach you how to swim at the pool in the park, so don't worry about it. Today turned out to be a flawless day. It really did. Yeah, no, it did. It really did. I wanted to bring a kite, but thought you'd laugh at me. <laughs> Why would I laugh at you? You're laughing right now. <laughs> Not because of... Oh my god, forget it. Interesting. What's happening? Went to the past. Stupid ghosts. What are you doing to me? this? Katie? Huh. Lots of names on there. Super bright so it's kind of hard to see. Hmm. This is interesting. I was going to end the it's been a spell since there, we did please. something, right? I feel like I haven't talked to you in a while. How have you been? What's been going on? How's classes? How's... Truthfully, I've... Um, I've... Ah, sorry. I think... Yeah, I... <laughs> I accidentally left my phone on the ferry, because I do things like that. <laughs> oh god, you idiot. Go get it before it leaves. When I get back, I want to hear an Alex story. <laughs> Can't I just come with you? I'll take two seconds! Think of something to tell me! So... Uh... <laughs> Do you... Well, I guess you don't remember anything, right? What am I meant to remember? I'm sorry, did I forget something? I'm uh, forget it. It's alright. Um, I'm glad we could all do stuff today. I'm glad you were cool with it, I mean. I know you guys are really close, and like, I know it can be annoying when somebody starts keeping all their time for their girlfriend or whatever. So, I think it would be cool if we could like, continue to do things together. Yeah, I uh, totally understand. And yeah, let's uh, do stuff, you know. Cool, cool. Michael, uh, he loves you, like, a lot. I'm sure you know that, but... He talks about you all the time. Super sad. <laughs> oh, Alex did this, and... Yeah, well, I love him too. Had to fight the skipper for it, but he didn't reckon how many squats I could do. What's it up to? Six? Only on burrito days. Ah, oh, Jesus, thank God you're back. It's like an eternity sitting here with this one. <laughs> Thanks a lot. No, I know what she's talking about. Hey, I'm interesting, I'm entertaining. <laughs> See? Even he can't keep it locked up. Okay, all right, I was joking. Don't salt the earth now. So, I actually really want a cold something, so I'm gonna run into town and get like a soda. Anybody want anything? Um, nah, I'm good. Uh, yeah, get me a drink too? Sure, I'll be back. 
Okay, I'm here. What's the story? I want the news. I want the Alex first edition. What's going on? Things are bad, actually. Mom and Dad aren't great, and I'm like a hair trigger away from spinning off this planet and- Hey, hey, look. First of all, Mom and Dad are Mom and Dad. They fight a lot, but they're whatever. Everything always blows over. It's gonna be fine. You're too young. We're too young to worry about marital discord. It's not gonna be fine. It's not gonna be fine. I I know how this goes. I have insider information, let's just call it, okay? Look, just because Janie's parents got a divorce and made poker nights super uncomfortable doesn't mean ours have to too, all right? And look, I know this was supposed to be our day, but I completely forgot I promised Clarissa I'd do something with her, so thanks for chaperoning. I know it's not what you had in mind, so... Yeah, no problem. Just don't get all smoochy smooch <laughs> general vicinity <laughs> because that would ever happen it's important to me that you like clarissa alex so tell me the truth what do you really think of her i like her stick with it stay with her if she makes you happy if she makes you laugh who am i to say anything otherwise <laughs> thank you good blessings good tidings <laughs> you know i never noticed that's a good looking jacket i should ask for it back i don't like my new one Feels like I got shoes on my arms or something. No way, Bucko. <laughs> oh no. Bucko, you have Don't end it. This is happy. Oh. No. no. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> okay, I am gonna end it here, so I will see you guys in the next one. We will go hunting for notes. Bye.